your hands. Ooh. I know someone's there. I'm a busy man. of Katika. <gasps> Keeper Orland. Katika is dead. M murdered. I went to bring her the copy of Moran she requested, but then her door was open. She never leaves it open. I looked in and... and Garrett has killed interpreter Katika, you say? Seize him and bring him to the council room. This is the only murder in our ranks since these halls were founded by the first of our ancestors. But Garrett had no reason to kill Kataka. Has he not walked in line with the prophecies before? Yet some say the prophecies point to him as brethren and betrayer. Surely he knew that the answer is Garrett killed Constantine. Yes, and Karis as well. His hands long. A thief. And no stranger to murder is not match the manner in which Kataka was killed. How could Garrett have been the one? Remember that we asked Garrett to join us, to share his knowledge and skill. 
But now we turn upon him without proof. Broken and destroys the clock tower. Petty vandalism Notice is Notice that the clock tower does appear that way from some angles. We must consider the implications. If that prophecy Any refers to one of the clock of... tower is irrelevant. The matter at hand is murder done by one who we accepted as our guest and brother. sentence is passed. You haven't listened to anyone else yet, Orland. Why start now? Silence! You are declared guilty of Interpreter Kataka's murder. Your punishment will be determined by the Council. Now remove him! I regret to inform you that Garrett has escaped. Very good. Call together the Keeper Enforcers. They will track him down and erase our problem.